Hello guys, today's our agenda is to prove this thing f equal to g m1 m2 by d square. Before starting this, uh, we need to know this question also. This is very important. State Newton's universal law of gravitation. It states that the force of gravitation between any two bodies is directly proportional to the uh, product of their masses and inversely proportional to the square of the distance between their centers this is very important this short, short question you need to learn okay now now let's come to the topic so f is equal to g m1 m2 by d square this is very important this question is okay now let's go to the question let's let's now let's see the answer so what we have to do here is you need to draw these two bodies this is mass m1 and this is mass m2 okay so distance um, between these two masses is d so what does this force f means here um, it means this is the force of attraction um, between this mass m1 and m2 i mean to say uh, this mass m1 um, attract this mass m2 by force f okay similarly this mass m2 attract this mass m1 um, by the force f the magnitude of force of attraction is same let us consider two bodies of masses m1 and m2 separated by a distance d this is the distance d distance of separation between m1 and m2 from their centers if the force of attraction between them is f according to newton's law of gravitation what newton's law of gravitation says the force of gravitation between any two bodies is directly proportional to the product of their masses whether this statement matches or not let's see it's here the force of gravitation between two masses is directly proportional see this is directly proportional to the product of their masses and the force of attraction is inversely proportional now second line of newton's universal law of gravitation the force of attraction between any two bodies is inversely proportional to the square of the distance you can see here square of the distance between the sentence centers in combining these two equations what we get we'll get these things in common this thing okay m1 m2 by d square okay put here g then our inverse relation will change into this sign equal to sign i mean um the relation in um, left hand side equal to the relation in right hand side only um, we introduce the constant sign okay this is g is known as universal gravitational constant okay where g is 
universal gravitational constant and its value is 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 newton meter square per kg square okay guys this much for today we have just proved f equal to gm on m2 by d square thank you so much for watching this video